Good morning, oil traders. It is August 4th. It's Friday, and we're at 8.39 a.m. Eastern here, so just over, or just under an hour away from the East Coast markets open here in North America. And for the time being, it looks like it might be another day for the bears. Um, we're starting out about a dime below previous close, um, making a push as I'm speaking right now back to 49. Uh, if we make it over 49 before the open, it might be it might open green at least. But uh, for now, based on the overnight pattern, it looks like we might be in for a red day, which of course for me is good news. Finally, <laughs> we'll see. Um, but uh, my targets remain unchanged nonetheless, and I'll look, be looking to exit at least one short position, if not more, depending on how far we go, starting at or below 48. Um, if we do climb, it's really just more patience. Um, if we do climb, I don't expect us to climb high. Um, we've had a few attempts already at uh, getting past the 50 mark and failed considerably. Um, you know, I mean, a dollar is considerable in my books. So uh, that's my thinking. It's probably going to require me to be patient at least for European close at 11.30 a.m. Eastern today um, and more than likely wait longer than even that. Um, we do have Baker Hughes rig count information coming out today as well this afternoon, but that tends not to have a material effect or at least hasn't had so lately, but we shall see. Um, for the time being, uh, I'm patient, expecting to be able to exit at least one short position, if not more than one. Um, we'll see how it develops and how far we go. Uh, I'd love to hear what you guys have in mind. Hit me up down below on the comments on YouTube or over on port, uh, tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio trades, charts, performance, etc. Uh, subscribe uh, to stay tuned and uh, I'll check back with you guys towards the end of trading today near 4 p.m. Eastern and until then, good luck. Cheers.